Japanese hospitality giant MGM Resorts International is laying off thousands of workers. This comes as casinos continue to struggle during this pandemic. 8 News Now reporter Orko Mana joins us live near the Strip with the details and how employees are responding. Orko. Well, Kirsten, MGM Resorts is one of Nevada's biggest employers, but it was announced today that 18,000 furloughed workers throughout the company are being let go. It's unclear how many of them are here in Las Vegas, but now they're trying to prepare for next steps. It's frustrating to, to be in the situation that we're in. A major casino company cutting back. MGM Resorts International announcing 18,000 employees who have been furloughed for the past six months will be laid off on Monday, August 31st. It's definitely a financial issue. I spoke to one of the employees from Las Vegas being let go who did not want to be identified. They got this letter from MGM, which explains properties are still not operating at full capacity due to COVID-19. Given Nevada's high rate of unemployment, workers are worried. When there's no jobs available and you're not receiving any, any jobs, any callbacks, um, it's, it's very discouraging. In a statement, MGM Resorts International CEO Bill Hornbuckle said in part, MGM will continue welcoming employees back as our reopening plan progresses and as business demand grows. Laid off employees will remain on the recall list, which is based on need, position and seniority, and they'll also stay on the company's health care plan through September 30th. So that's a, a big weight off my shoulders. Still, hospitality experts say we could see more of this. As the pandemic continues to go on, it may be that more casino companies find it necessary to lay off more employees. To make ends meet right now, the MGM worker I spoke to says they cashed in their 401k. Knowing that's your, your bread and butter for, for when you retire is, is, is a frustrating thing. Laid off workers can still see and apply for MGM job postings before they become publicly available. And also workers who return to work by the end of December 2021 will have their benefits resumed immediately. Reporting live near the Las Vegas Strip tonight, Orcomana 8 News Now.